How's it going, Orange? Oh, you know, I'm... Oh. Dude, you don't look too good. Oh, hey, hey, Pear. Yeah, what is it, Orange? Blech! Oh. 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 Gross. I don't feel so good, Pear. You're gonna have to take over. Sure, no prop. Wait, what? Uh, hey, hey, Turnip? Hey, Turnip, hey. Hey, what's up, Pear? Yeah, it's just that I'm glad you could uh, turn up. <laughs> what? You know, turn up. <laughs> what are you getting at, man? N nothing. It's it's just a joke. You know, like turn up. W what are you talking about? You, you think I'm I'm late? Well, no, it's just. It's I'm just a late blooming vegetable. All right. I'm ready when I'm ready. No, okay, okay, okay. I'm not running on your schedule or anyone else's. You hear me? Uh, okay. I'm sorry. You're bombing, pear. Look, I've never done this before. Just call him something he's not. That always works for me. All right. Hey, hey, turn up. I'm not talking to you. Good, because you're just a fat radish. <laughs> Get it? Fat radish? <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 turn up, dude. Why are you doing this to me? Way to go, Pear. Jeez, I didn't know he was gonna cry. Oh my god, what's going on here? Pear made Turnip cry. No, no, it's not like that. <laughs> he called me fat. Pear, what's wrong with you? No, this is Orange's fault. He told me to do it. Hey, keep it down. I'm having a sick day over here. Is that all you have to say for yourself, Pear? <laughs> Dude, you gotta help me get out of this. What do I say now? Uh, I don't know. I just usually make funny noises. Everyone loves that. All right. Hey, 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 turn up, hey. What do you want now? Hey, I, I bet you can't do this. Ow, 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 what, is that supposed ow, to be me? Because I'm ow, fat, right? Because I'm always ow, eating. No, ow, Pear's just trying ow, to, ow, you know, cheer ow, you up. Ow, right, Pear? Ow. <laughs> You're a monster! Pear? I'm sorry! No, no, no. You're doing it all wrong, Pear. It's more like this. <laughs> oh. Ew! Oh, I don't remember eating that. Uh, look. Why don't we all just call it a night? Huh, guys? Yeah, I second that. Okay. Uh, hey! Hey, Fat Radish! Orange! I'm not a Fat Radish! No, not you. Fat Radish! What's up with you, Orange? Knife! Yeah! Here's wishing you a fruitastic birthday full of... Huh? Yeah! Relax, guys. Jeez. I'm just here to cut the birthday cake. Oh, oh ah. that's a relief! Wait, he's about to cut what? Ba 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 la 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 orange. <laughs> hey, it's your turn, Pear. Hey, who took Pear? Hooray, Hooray for, for Christmas. 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 Hooray. Uh, guys, I think there's been a little bit of a mix up here. Come on, Bells. Time to play our song. <laughs> What's wrong with the new bell? Yeah, you see, I I'm not really a bell. Ah, uh, come on, Pear. All you have to do is bell-leave you are. <laughs> you look like a bell. Not really. And you have the Christmas spirit of a bell. Uh, okay. Come on, you're a bell. Act like it. He's a real ringer. <laughs> if you don't fill the air with Christmas cheer, how will Santa sleigh fly? How will Rudolph's nose glow? How will angels get their wings? Okay, okay, okay. Jeez, enough of the guilt tripping. Seriously, my ears won't stop ringing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just take it from the top. Yay! Um, ding. Hooray! Ding. 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 Oh, oh, ding. I want to play. Ding. Got any threes? Go, Bash! Flyer! I can see a three right there in your hand! No! Bash! Hey, de hi, de ho, de. I am Sven, the Swedish fish. I am here as a foreign exchange student. <gasps> that accent. It's. 
It's just so... Weird? Over the top? Potentially culturally insensitive? It's so sexy. Ah! Since I am so new to your kitchen, I was hoping someone might be willing to show me around. I volunteer. Guys, I think we need to get accents. What accent are you studying, Orange? Oh, I'm gonna go with Russian. It sounds so tough. Quite a manly. <laughs> I'm studying French. Girls love the French accent. That's why I brought in a vocal coach. Oui, oui, let us begin. Hello, my name is Little Lapin. Stress the O's. Loosen your jaw. Pretend your tongue is made of jelly, huh? Hello, my name is Little Lapin. More with the O's. Less intelligible. Imagine your whole mouth is soupy nonsense, huh? Mwah. Lapin, my name is Little Lapin. Now I have no clue what you're even trying to say. You're finally getting French, huh? I'm going with Canadian because it's so easy. Let's hear it. I'm doing it right now. That's not an accent. That's just your normal voice. Exactly. The Canadian accents sound exactly like ours, except for one word. See if you can guess which one. My name is Grapefruit. I'm a Libra, and I love weightlifting. But enough about me. Let's talk about you. What's with Canadians and boots anyway? It's really cold up there, so winter boots are constantly on their minds. <laughs> what a boot you bear! What accent are you gonna use to impress the ladies? I don't know. Maybe Australian? Ooh, that's a good one! Might even win over some guys with an Australian accent. <laughs> Let's hear it, Pear! Hey, mate! Put another shrimp on the bar, babe! Um, that's horrible! Not even close, dude! I'll have the blooming onion, please! Colder! Definitely cold! Tie me kangaroo down, sport! Pear, do everyone a favor and never attempt an accent ever again. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Oh, they're coming back! Everyone, get your accents ready! If I had any idea the foods in American kitchens were all as beautiful as this, I would have come much sooner. <laughs> Hello, passion? Orange, what's wrong with your voice? Nothing wrong. I make conversation in normal fashion. Is there something stuck in your esophagus? Bonjour, ladies! What? Make your mouth soupier. Bonjour! I have no idea what you're saying. Soupier, you fool! Bonjour! You know, Sven, I've lived in the kitchen my whole life. I'd be happy to tell you anything you'd like to know about it. What's going on? Why are you guys talking so weird? Crikey! Look at that wallaby! Ugh, come on. These boys are being weird. It was a pleasure to meet you. Bye, Sven! See ya a boot! <laughs> hey, that's my accent, dude! Stop stepping on my game! No! Boot! Huh? Ah! <gasps> ah! I, I, I'm okay. My vocal cords appear to have been crushed. Uh, however, I guess this is my new voice now. Ugh. So, what part of the kitchen would you ladies like to show me next? Um, maybe you should show yourself around. Yeah. Bye. Crikey! Welcome to the club, man! Dude, just no. Yeah, I'm sorry. What? A full moon! Oh, I'll give you a full moon! <laughs> Orange! No! But, no buts, remember? It's literally what we agreed on after last time! Yeah, fine. Alright, see you guys. I'm off to see Paris. Um, you're flying out tonight, Pear? Everyone knows that weird spooky things happen when there's a full moon out. Let alone when there are two full moons out. <laughs> Orange! You guys are too superstitious. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm already late to catch my plane and... Whoa! Hey now, no need to have a hissy fit. <laughs> Pear, a black cat just crossed your path. That's the most unlucky thing that could have happened. You can't fly to Paris tonight. That much is plain. Exactly. That much is plain. No! Plain! Well, I can't believe you're getting another flight! Yeah, haven't you ever watched Final Destination? My favorite documentary? Oh, come on! That's all just superstitious baloney! No, I'm superstitious baloney, okay? Literally. And uh, you cheated death, so stay away from me, bro, because simply put, you're doomed! Uh, hello? Yes. I'd like to get on the last flight to Paris. Thanks. Don't go, Pear! You heard what the deli-
really needs said. Au revoir, fellas. Yeah, wait! Well, that's not good. Yeah, nothing's gonna happen to me. There are black cats everywhere. Planes crash into the kitchen surprisingly often. <laughs> ah! 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 Pear, what's the matter? Whoa! Little apple, get over here. Chop, chop. <laughs> well, do you believe us now, Pear? Not in the slightest. Guys, it was dark and I bumped into some knives. That doesn't mean death is chasing me. It could happen to anybody. Ah! Oh! Ah! <laughs> Guys, I'm sure there's a perfectly reasonable explanation why the burner turned on and why a bowling ball fell out from nowhere. And why die, pair, die is scratched into that wall by cat claws? Huh? Uh, face it, you're doomed, bro. Okay, uh, chaos theory. Get lost, baloney. You're not helping. Pear, you got to believe us. This is exactly like Final Destination, which, again, is my favorite documentary. It's not a documentary, Orange. Guys, just relax, okay? I'm going to Paris now. Death is not chasing me. Pear? All of these things could have happened to anyone. Uh, Pear? They all just so happened to happen to me. One after another. Pear! Ah! <laughs> wow! Well, that sure was shocking. <laughs> horror, horror! Pear! Run! <laughs> Let's just see where the heck I am. Ah! 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 Oh, a rope. Okay, I'll use this to escape. No! Oh, well, we heard you scream. Are you all right, Pear? It sounded like you had a nightmare. Hey, that rhymed. <laughs> oh, it, it was just a dream. Oh, wow. Oh, what a relief. Okay, let's just get on with our day and... <gasps> what up, fruit lovers? A to the O here with the whole gang. Say hey, everybody. Yo, 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 yo. Today, we're doing a never-before-seen challenge, the Scare Pear Challenge. <laughs> Cool. Sounds like a bundle of fun. It's a bundle of fun for sure. <laughs> Here's how it works. Pear's gonna sit his little hiney here and one by one, me and the gang are gonna take cracks at making him scream the loudest. We all excited to do this? Yeah! yeah! No. Then it's unanimous. Here's the Scare Pear Challenge coming at ya. <laughs> uh. Hi, Pear. Hey, Marshy. Sure. I mean, you could try. It's kind of hard to hug someone when you don't have any... Tentacles! Ah! <laughs> Did I scare you? Yeah, kinda. How did you... Thanks, baby octopus! I'm looking for a friend! <laughs> Marshy, you've got some weird friends. Cute, but weird. The scare o meter gave Bear Scream 75 decibels. Marshy takes the lead! Yay! Ooh, I'm a scary girl! Yeah, you're something, all right. Aw, oh, man, are you really not scared? Sorry, little apple. Not scared at all. Nah, and to think I went to all the trouble of studying up on ghosts at the library before it burned down. Huh? The library burned down? No! <laughs> gotcha, Pear! The library didn't burn down? Oh, thank goodness. That's 76 decibels. Congrats, Little Apple. You've moved into the lead by the smallest of margins. <laughs> Excuse me, could somebody tell me what I'm doing here again? You're trying to scare me, Grandpa Lemon. Oh, I see. Well, I've got a little trick up my sleeve. Here, hold these. Uh, ew! Okay, I'll be back. Where is he going? Hello? Grandpa Lemon? Anybody? What the heck is going on? Where is everybody? Right here! Ah! 
<laughs> How did you do that? A magician never reveals his... Oh, good grief. The Scarometer gave it an 85. Congrats to Grandpa Lemon, our new front runner. Thank you kindly. <laughs> <laughs> you don't stand a chance, bro. I brought the scariest thing of all time, a tarantula. I'm not scared of tarantulas. You, you not? Even though they're huge and hairy and could eat you? Nope, but it seems like you are. Nuh-uh, I'm, I'm not scared of anything. Then open the cage. Maybe I will. Cool, so do it. I'm gonna. When? Soon. How about now? Don't rush me! <laughs> Yo, what's with that guy? I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. Oogie boogie! Oogie boogie boogie boogie! Oogie boogie! Not scary! Ah, man! Okay, let me try a different mask then. Yeah, I don't think it's the mask. I think it's the fact that you're not doing anything surprising. <laughs> <laughs> Orange! <laughs> I so got you! What the? I put a mask on an orange ball! See? <laughs> I'll admit, that was a good one! Thanks for the help, knife! You're welcome. See you tomorrow when I try to kill you for reals! Bye! Okay. And the scream meter agrees! That was 97 decibels, which means I win the grand prize! Well, I didn't know there was a grand prize! Yeah, what's the grand prize? This megaphone! No! Me You learn something new every day. Hey! Hey, Pierre! Um, hey, Orange. Hey, Pierre! Dude, are you okay? Pierre! Wanna go in the freezer? Um, no. Why not? There's a whole library of boring books in there. It's fun in the freezer. It's ice to meet the freezer, Pierre. <laughs> Ooh, Marshy! Hey, Marshy, hey! Did you know that there are rainbows in the freezer? Really? And grapefruit. There are sexy lady grapefruits in the freezer, too. Wow, wouldn't have expected them to be hanging out in the freezer. <laughs> Wait, are you guys serious? You can't honestly trust Orange. He's acting so... funky. Funky? I like funky. You can get funky in the freezer, Pierre. <laughs> funky in the freezer. Ooh, funky in the freezer. Oh, see? Sorry, Pierre. Gonna need to check out these ladies. You understand. We love what the crap? Well, that wasn't ominous at all. Don't worry, guys. I'm sure Marshy and Grapefruit are just fine. Yay! That was fun! Oh, Marshmallow, Grapefruit, you're okay. Yeah, it's so much fun in the freezer, Pierre. You guys should try it. Yeah, I'm gonna pass on that one. Yeah! Try it, guys. Yeah, try it. it. Just, you know, give it a whirl. What is going on? Can we chill it with the weirdness? <laughs> chill it. Chill it, chill it in the freezer. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. go to the freezer. Chill it. Oh, my God. Uh, we're not going in the freezer. Uh, something really creepy is going on here. Yeah, everyone that goes into the freezer comes out possessed. Exactly. I think the freezer might be haunted. I agree. 
I think we should get out of here, like now! Finally, an idea I can agree with. Where'd you leave your monster truck? I parked it in the freezer. Got it! Little apple, no! Wait, my monster truck isn't in here. Stop for crying out loud. No! No one is ever going in that freezer ever again! You shouldn't do that, Pierre! You're gonna regret that, man! There! No more freezer weirdness! Now life can go back to normal! We scream! We all A dream. Oh. There! What's wrong? I heard you screaming! Oh, it was nothing. Just a bad dream. Oh, well, I brought you something I think might make you feel better. Um, thanks, I guess. No problem! Night bear! Oh. <laughs> Happy birthday! I got you a set of measuring cups! Yeah, That is such a weak gift! What? It's practical! Everybody needs measuring cups! Well, I got you a hip-hop velociraptor! Okay, now that's a terrible gift! Hey, yeah! Oh, yeah! Yeah! Go, Raptor! Go, go Raptor! Raptor! Go, go Raptor! Raptor! Nothing like getting out for a little fresh air. Hey, hey, Pear! Is this what you meant when you told me to take a hike? <laughs> uh, so much for peace and quiet. Hey, hey, Pear! Get a load of those tracks! Whoa! I wonder what made them. A doy? It was obviously a big foot. <laughs> yep, I hope we didn't shoo it away. <laughs> huh? Ah, forget it. Perhaps this is a mystery that was never meant to be solved. Sasquatch, get your Sasquatch swag. Huh? Step right up, ash only, no checks. Hey, hey Squash, hey! No, 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 I'm Sassy Squash. You get it? Uh. It's called branding, kids. Look into it. Huh? Why would you want to brand a kid? Ow! What is that? Why, it's the official Sasquatch spotting flashlight. Give that Yeti a run for his money. Only $39.95. But for you guys, we'll call it 50 even. Ah, sorry, Sassy, but we're a few bucks light. <laughs> Look, we're not here to buy anything. We don't even know what a Saska whatever is. Nuh-uh, that's my favorite soda. Don't you want to want the Saska? Don't you want to want the Saska? <laughs> what? You two knuckleheads never heard of the Sasquatch? For crying out loud, it's the mythical missing link. Oh, you mean that guy? Stupid GPS, forget Zelda. Just tell me which way is north. No, not him, Sasquatch. The guy on the t-shirt, the giant man monster that left those footprints. Oh yeah, cause I'm sure it wasn't that plunger with a footprint on it. Oh, so now I'm a fraud. Why don't you tell it to that guy? Huh, what guy? Yeah, there's nobody there. Oh, wow, it's Sasquatch whatever. Ah! Ooga booga, ooga booga. Come on, Orange, you're just wearing a stupid mask. I want one! Haha, <laughs> works every time. Shut up and take my money! Take it! Orange, this isn't the mall. We don't have to buy things to have a good time. Uh... What the? You like that? It's a Sasquatch call. Pretty neat, huh? Meh, I prefer texting. <laughs> okay, we're leaving now. Okay, I'll race you. Really? Sure. Yeti, set, go! <laughs> nice. I'm gonna put that one on a t-shirt. Speaking of which, either of you in the market for a hoodie? Uh... Hey, put that down. You break it, you bought it. Uh-oh, I've got a foot in my mouth. A big 
for it. <laughs> I'm serious, pal. This ain't no lending library. Oh, oh, hey, Gordy, check it out. Sasquatch on a motorboat. <laughs> Not cool, dude. Not cool. <laughs> You're nuttier than trail mix, you... You twerp. Nuh-uh, I'm not a twerp, I'm a Sasquatch. <laughs> twerp, Sasquatch, twerp, Sasquatch, twerp, big foot. Huh? <laughs> ah! Oh my god, Squash really lived up to his name. It's a, it's a. Hey, hey Sasquatch, booga booga booga, booga booga booga. <laughs> booga booga, booga booga booga. booga, booga. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Ahab, will you never learn? Finally! Watch out, tummy, because it's chamomile tea time! Mmm, yummers! So relaxing. Somebody's gonna be getting to bed at a reasonable hour tonight. <sighs> wow, Bear's really putting the dumb in boredom. It's like watching a tube sock do his taxes! He's so lame! Totes, he makes watching paint dry seem exciting. He's so boring, he makes vanilla yawn! He's so dull! I skipped his birthday party just to attend an insurance seminar! I once confused him for a paralyzed horse! They're so boring! He... You know I can hear you guys, right? Well, duh! Why do you think we're talking so loud? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, fellas! Let's beat feet before Captain Blah puts me to sleep. Later, Pear. Don't go doing anything exciting. <laughs> uh, who am I kidding? That'll never happen. <laughs> <sighs> Got him. 
Almost got him. Oh! What the? Dude, two apples just fell off the counter. No time to talk, Pear. Gotta focus. Has the whole kitchen gone crazy? Foods are falling off the counter left and right, you guys. And for what? A game about little digital food monsters? You think this is a game, Pear? As a matter of fact, yes, I do. You know, we were gonna ask you to join Team Orange, but maybe now we'll just pass. So sorry about that. I was trying to catch a catching mine. That's totally understandable. Did you catch it, though? Yeah, I did. All right, you've all lost your minds. I'm out of here. Hmm, what do you guys think? Is Pear right? Have we gone too far with this kitchen mon go stuff? Uh, I'd like to propose just the opposite. Pear is wrong, and as far as I'm concerned, we haven't gone far enough. I like how this guy thinks. <laughs> it's just so sad to think that Pear will never appreciate Kitchen Mon Go the way we do. You'll never get the chance to experience Kitchen Mon Go like we have. Well, there is one way. Dr. Bananas? It's untested, but my latest invention, the Monifier, is capable of turning real fruits into real Kitchen Mon. Oh man, oh man, oh man, test it on me! I wanna live as a Kitchen Mon! Oh, this is a dream I never even knew I had until this very moment! Peace out, suckers! I'm gonna be a Kitchen Mon with an awesome Kitchen Mon life and never look back! I was going to suggest we test it on Pear. That way he could be a real part of the phenomenon that is Kitchen Mon Go! Yeah, that makes sense! All right, what to read tonight? The thesaurus or the dictionary? Well, considering I've already read the dictionary... Ah! Ah! Did it work? Did what work? Why did you just zap me? Uh, no reason. Is this part of your weird little cell phone game? Just leave me alone. Guys, Pear's right. We should leave him alone. <laughs> Whoa, what's, what's happening to me? Wow! Whoa! Oh, well, this is so weird. I mean, it's pretty cool too, but also really weird. That's a really cool power. I bet with those mines, he could even take on Pika Stew. All right, wait, 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 why are you all looking at me like that? What's going on here? Stay away. Stay away from me! Pear, we're really sorry to do this to you, but we gotta catch you! What? No! With some training, just imagine what you could become! <laughs> gotta catch him! Ah! Ah! Hey! Would you stop throwing weird digital balls at my face? Uh-oh, I think I might get, I'm almost out of balls, but I think I might have him. Gah! Would you guys look up from your phone for two seconds? Your friends are falling to their deaths! Worth it! Hey, I've got you now! Uh, uh, orange! Stop! I can't stop! I'm addicted! And Kitchen Mon Go is more important than friendship! I'm sorry, but it is! No! Kitchen Mon Go for one day, don't you think? Maybe you should get back to the counter? Huh? What's he talking about? Oh. Done now? Yeah. Just gonna grab something to drink. Oh, maybe some ice water! Great. See you later. Oh! <laughs> Why would you do that? Well, duh. Everybody's doing it. To themselves. Everyone's doing it to themselves. I'm confused. Why would anybody prank themselves? <laughs> it's not a prank, Orange. They're doing it to help fight ALS. Hey, you stay away from Alice. She didn't do nothing to you. You tell him, Orange. Not Alice, A-L-S. It's a disease. People are pouring buckets of ice water on themselves to raise awareness and donate money to find a cure. Oh, well in that case, let the healing begin! Ha! Yo dudes, what's going on? Ah! Oh, you jerks! I was just about to do the ice bucket challenge on my channel! Dude, stop being so selfish. Orange, you're doing this all wrong. Well, if helping a noble cause is wrong, then I don't want to be right. Yay! Oh, that's cool, baby. <laughs> Best charity ever. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs>
No! Oh, look at the water ripple on my muscles! <laughs> it's freezing. One, just one, and then you are done. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, suddenly I feel like I've learned the folly of my ways. Oh, can I do a do-over? No. Eh, so what happens now? Well, if you had done it right, you could nominate someone else for the challenge. But in this case, I think you'd better just cough up a donation. Good call. <laughs> Dude, gross. What? Don't they take Visa? <laughs> yeah! Uh... <laughs> yeah, and that's how I got a date with Nicki Minaj. Wow, good story. Man, I had the weirdest dream last night. Yeah? What happened? Well, for some reason, everyone in the kitchen was able to barf up whole fish. Entire fish! I know, right? Super weird. Not really. You sure it was a dream? I mean, I can barf up a whole trout anytime I want. Yeah, me too! What? Sure, watch. <laughs> what the? You try. There's no way! I can't do that! Oh, really? Oh, oh what's happening? Well, <laughs> Oh, 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 it was just another dream. Dude, are you okay? It sounded like you were sleep barfing or something. <laughs> yeah, I guess I kind of was. Okay, let me pour you some medicine for that. No, I'm fine now. It was just, wait, why is that pouring up? It's not, it's pouring down. Well then why are we on the ceiling then? We're not, dude, we're on the wall. The wall? Duh. Okay, why is gravity so messed up? Dude, you up? Uh, I'm not sure. This might just be another dream. What do you mean? Ah! 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 <laughs> Look how small he is. <laughs> Orange, you okay? No, I'm not okay. I'm stuck in the middle of some creepy weird fish barfception dream sequence. Fish barfception? What are you talking about? You mean, you've never seen anyone barf up a fish? What? Of course not. And you've never stood on a wall and poured medicine sideways? Dude, you are talking crazy. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> okay, now I know you're crazy. I'm home! I made it home! Woohoo! Yay! <laughs> yeah! What's up with Orange? No clue. He's going on about barfing up fish or something. That's so weird. Everyone knows there's no such thing as barfing up fish. Only dolphins! I know, right? <laughs> Care for some ceiling tea? Don't mind if I do! I mean, have we not solved it already? Is it tomatoes or is it tomatoes? Can't the tomatoes just get together, hold a meeting and call the whole thing off? And what's the deal with airplane food? Does anybody actually like this stuff? Hey, I'm airline food. My mother's airline food. Uh-oh, looks like there's a problem in the peanut gallery. On the new secretary at work? Precisely, at the annual company party. I see a couple holes in your plan. First, do you even know her name? Not a clue. Secondly, and perhaps most importantly, women hate you. Not a problem, I've got a plan. A plan to get bigger somehow? What, no, I was gonna get a wig. Oh. Wait, are you telling me women don't like that I'm small? Well, I thought it was because I was bald. I honestly can't say, I'm not a woman. Oh, 
Hey, guys. Passion, do women not like me because I'm small or because I'm bald? We don't like you because you're an idiot. Fair enough. So, how was your date last night? It was okay. Me and this guy watched a little Adventure Time, and then we went back to his place, yada, yada, yada. Wait, you just yada, yada, yada over the best part. Yeah, you can't yada, yada, yada over the best part. No, I, I told you about Adventure Time. Anyway, you guys heard about this new soup place across town? It's supposed to be amazing. Anyone want to go before the party? Pear does! I do? Pear, you've got to keep Passion distracted. She cannot come to my company's party till after nine. Why not? Because there'll be dancing until nine. You remember the last time Passion danced? Of course. It's seared into my memory forever. I almost vomited. No dancing Passion. It'll ruin my chances with the secretary. It'll throw the whole thing off. All right, all right. Great. Ah, I'm off to buy a wig. Hey, we talking about wigs over here? Cause I can totally get you a wig. Really? Oh yeah, I know a guy. He sells wheat germ wigs in Central Park. 20 bucks a pop. Oh, well, that's super cheap. Are they any good? Good, they're great. Trust me, you've never worn a wig until you've worn a wheat germ wig. Well, if you say so. Oh, I almost forgot. What time is your company party? Uh, later, much later, I huh? hope. Uh, oh, and remember, when you meet my boss, make sure to pronounce his name exactly right. Oh yeah? How does he say it? Toma too. I beg your pardon? Toma too. It's French or something. That's it. We got tomato and tomato, and now we got a whole other one to worry about. I say no. I refuse. I'm calling the whole thing off. Next. I cannot wait to try this soup. Um, I, I don't have anything smaller than a 20. No soup. Ah! Eesh. This guy's being a real Nazi about this stuff, isn't he? Yeah, but apparently the soup's so great, so you just have to put up with him. Oh no, grapefruit's here. Hello, pear. Hello, grapefruit. <laughs> Trying the soup, eh? That's right. I've been enjoying the finer aspects of our city all day. In fact, I just picked up some premium wheat germ at Central Park. Next. Hi, um, do you have minestrone? It's pronounced minestrone. Really? Cause I've always heard minestrone. That's it! No soup for you! What? The possibly mispronouncing soup? Yes, get out! Ugh, whatever. Let's just go to the party pair. Uh, party? But, but you don't wanna... Next! I'll have the toasted wheat germ soup, please. Excellent choice. Oh, no. We appear to be out of wheat germ. Oh, well, then today's your lucky day. <laughs> It's just, it's just, what? Do you smell something? No, probably nothing. Whoa, who's she? That's her! Oh, and she's wearing a name tag. Perfect! This is Little Apple's time to strike! Hello there! Little Apple, from accounts. That's me! Fancy seeing you here, potato! Oh, actually, it's potato. Pardon? Potato. It's French. Is that so? My name is French as well. Little Apple, care to introduce me to this stunning young woman? Well, of course. Mr. Tomatu, meet Miss Potatu. A pleasure to meet you, Mr. Tomatu. The pleasure is all mine, Miss Potatu. Come, let me show you my numerous sports cars. Perhaps we'll take a ride. Ah! My boss just stole the girl of my dreams. Could this get any worse? Check out that lady on the dance floor. What? <laughs> We couldn't get soup. Passion made me come right here. Yeah. Is it me or does this place reek of rancid wheat germ? What? Are you saying my wig is past due? I'm saying your wig is turned, little apple. The germ is turned. Oh, the germ is turned! The germ is turned! Oh, what's that smell? Oh no! The wig's ruining the party! Eh, I'd say it's already ruined. Wait, isn't that your girl with Mr. Tomato? Hey, hey! It's Tomatu to you. Now get out of here. What? For mispronouncing your name? Yes. Get out. No party for you. Woo! This is my jam. Don't worry, Pear. I have a feeling this party's about to go south. Her dancing was so horrible. I think I'm gonna barf. You guys want to get a bite? Yeah, I could eat. Diner? Chinese? Oh! We should get soup! 
my soup! It's rancid! Oh no! This germ has turned! I use turn germ! Oh! Ugh, I'm never coming back here again! Me neither! Me! I use turn germ! It's not too much, is it? Are you kidding? It's great. Yeah, you look just like Miss Pac-Man. <laughs> har har, can it, dude? I just want to look fly for my date. You want to look like a fly? You should just wing it. <laughs> no, Orange, he wants to look good for the double date. Pear's dating two ladies? Wow! No, Orange, you and Passion are going on a double date with me and my new lady friend. <laughs> me and Passion? Huh? I'm not in love. Double date? <laughs> Whatever, you're crazy. This isn't a double date. That's a double Date. Oh, looking fly, boy. <laughs> Not them. Our double date. We talked about this. Hey, dude, would you want to take passion on a double date? Uh, yeah, whatever. I can't talk right now. I'm busy alphabetizing my TNT collection. Okay, sounds good. Later. But that's not fair. I wasn't paying attention. I was so busy. <sighs> well, Pear, I can't wait to meet, uh, well, wait, what is she again? Well, I don't actually know. We met online. Her name is Pairing, so I'm guessing she's probably a... Knife? <laughs> no, ha ha. Don't be ridiculous. Knife! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> well, hello there. Gulp. And I was like, that's crazy. Cause my name is Pairing, which is just like Pear, but with an ing. Isn't that totally crazy? Hmm, it's more like psycho. <laughs> Orange. Ugh, quiet down. I'm trying to get to know my new BF. Hey, no fair. Pear's my best friend. <laughs> that's not what BF means. <laughs> oh, oh, you, that's uh, quite the sense of humor you got there. <laughs> Well, duh, you don't have to tell me that I'm funny. So, uh, pairing, do you have any hobbies or interests or? And done. Oh, sorry. I was just changing my relationship status. Oh, and I uploaded a picture. <laughs> Isn't she great? Oh, as long as I'm here, I'll just change yours too, honey. Just as soon as I get done reading this email from your mom. Wait, did you hack into my profile? Wow, she really is sharp. <laughs> well, that's not cool. You can't just... What? That honey? Um, well, uh... I think Pear's just trying to say that there's good sharing and then there's bad sharing and well... Oh, back off, sister. I am not sharing my pair with anybody. You go, girlfriend. <laughs> okay, dude, that's not helping. Honey, is he... Whoa! Hey guys, I know. Why don't we just play a game? Huh? Oh, please, yes! Yes, that is a great idea! I'm really good at operation. <laughs> um, how, how about. Oh, oh, motorboat! No, Orange, that's not a good idea. Ugh, what the heck? Ah! No, no, stop! Stop! Yay! Did I win or was it a tie? <laughs> <gasps> oh, oh, oh. oh my god, that was so much fun. I just love spending time with you. Yeah, yeah, that was a good time. Uh, I'm having fun as well. <laughs> What's the matter, Pear? Get a little hot under the collar? <laughs> Don't worry, baby. I feel the same way. Hey, hey, Pear! If you guys get engaged, would pairing be your fiance? Slay? Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry, but that was actually funny. <laughs> yes, yes, of course I'll marry you, Pear. Oh, we're going to be so happy forever. Oh my God. Oh, this isn't happening. What's that, honey? I said, no, okay, this is crazy. You're a knife and I'm a fruit. We're not getting married. We're not even going out and furthermore, you're insane. Wow. Guess I read that one all wrong. Nice one, Pear. Way to let her down easy. I just feel so sad. Oh, no, 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 no. Look, look, look. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, okay? It's just that... Okay, please stop. You're gonna rust. And when I get sad, I get... I get angry. Uh-oh. And when I get angry, I get savvy. Okay, oh, oh, okay, okay, I'm sorry. I, I, I take it all back. I take it all back. Yay! I knew you guys would make up. Parent, pairing, sitting in a tree. K-N-I-F-I-N-G. Are you mocking me? Ah! First comes love, then comes marriage.
Midge! Orange, shut up! Then comes Midget Apple in a baby carriage! Watch out! This thing doesn't have any brakes! in the road, but never a knife. <laughs> Did that baby carriage just explode? <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's a long story. Well, can you just give us the short version? <laughs> oh, little Apple, I don't know how to thank you. You totally saved my life. Well, you could start by introducing me to your little friends over there. That is just what I need. Um, am I alone in thinking that revisiting the past is totally not Neato Burrito? Yeah, middle school is a really awkward time for everyone, and I'd prefer to forget it. I mean, not even Marshmallow's excited. I like yearbooks! Nah! Ah! <laughs> Check out Grapefruit's weak attempt at a mustache! Hey, for middle school, that mustache wasn't half bad! Wow! Well, I'd forgotten Marshmallow wore headgear! <laughs> girl with pear. That's Liz and her family moved away to Michigan and it crushed my heart into a zillion pieces! <laughs> Whoa! Well, I think we might have opened a real can of worms here. Can of worms? Say, wasn't that Grapefruit's first girlfriend? Ah! <laughs> All right, your book time is over. Give me that! I don't know what you guys are talking about. Middle school is the best. I was at the top of my game. See? Where are you? I don't see you. Right there, in the middle. Don't you remember? Well, I was the tallest kid in seventh grade. Oh, yeah. That was right before everyone else hit their growth spurts. <laughs> well, I'll tell you. Those were the days. They assigned me a top locker and everything. <sighs> I miss middle school, you guys. Well, I was voted most likely to play in the NBA. I was voted most likely to say yay. I was voted most likely to succeed. I just remembered that. Oh boy, I'm having a real existential moment right now. What have I done with my life? What were you voted, Orange? Most likely to prank Vice Principal Plum. <laughs> and let me tell you guys, I delivered. See? Oh yeah, there's the time you put his hairpiece on the ceiling with super glue. <laughs> oh, and I remember this, the time you trapped him inside a vending machine. How'd you even do that, Orange? It's incredible! Eh, I don't mean to toot my own horn, but I was pretty darn good at pranks back in the day. <laughs> All right, let's see what parents voted. Most likely to marry Liz. Should not have brought that up. Say, where is Pear? He's over there, listening to Lincoln Park and writing poetry. She moved away right before the spring fling dance. I never got to say goodbye. Probably time to put the yearbook away. Let's burn the yearbook so we never revisit it again! <laughs> or we could find Liz on Fruit Book and orchestrate a long overdue reunion with Pear! That sounds like a horrible idea. Agreed. Oh, well, what if I already did that and she's on her way right... Pear? Liz? Oh, no! It's been a while. You look great. You too! I'm sorry we moved away so suddenly. It's, it's okay. I hear Michigan is nice. Oh no! There are a lot of things to talk about already! Whoa! This is even more awkward than middle school was! <laughs> Wait! This is my chance! Maybe I can help them fall in love and finally do something important with my life! Boy, how about this weather we're having, huh? Totally. Totes. Totes my goats. Totes. Huh? Go for it, buddy! <laughs> oh, uh, um, Liz? May I have this dance? <laughs> you may. Hold up. Let's leave some room, lovebirds. Vice, Vice Principal, Principal Plum? Plum? Yeah. Saw your little Facebook post and figured you kids would need a chaperone. Now where's Orange? Never got a chance to thank him for all the years of torture he put me through. Orange? Um, I think he's over there. Where? Um, I saw him going to that vending machine over there. Finally. <laughs> I've got it. Huh? So that's how it happened! Oh, I can't believe I fell for this again! Let me out! Let me out! Cool dance! Everybody do the Vice Principal Plum! <laughs> Stay 
Damn!